Me, myself, I is a unique photography project which aims to look at self-identity in older age, leading to a more positive self-identity. This time we decided that we would aim it at older LGB and T people, so that's lesbian, gay, bisexual and transgender. The participants were given the opportunity to work with a professional arts photographer, Emmett McSheffrey. They went through a series of workshops. Then they worked individually to realise four photographic assignments. A self-portrait, transitions, my world and my dreams. My theme in, in, for my dreams is um, I've always thought I'd like to dance, to be a dancer. I think flamenco is beautiful. I love Indian dance as well. Um, I, I love the, the, that whole different formations with the hands and the body. If I start really focusing on my dreams, things could happen. I never thought of myself as a creative person at all. The themes by chance were very th important themes for a transgender person. And the only way that I can represent these images uh, wouldn't be as static because my life has never been static. Uh, and I wanted to portray a sense of what my life was like before and the journey that I'm still on. I have found an ability to be able to express myself uh, and whatever art form that is, I want to experiment with everything. Uh, so this has been a life changing course for me. Seeing the end product in the Void Gallery on a wall for public display, I could see, and I hope everybody else, my members of my family, my sisters, my nephews, the actual pain there in a photograph of what I went through for 32 years of my life. And actually, it was the greatest relief. So this project was very, very worthwhile for me. I thoroughly enjoyed uh, being part of this project. Uh, I think it enabled me in some way to uh, process the recent death of my uh, partner. Uh, I think the whole uh, symbolism uh, was very important in that. So for example in my transitions uh, photograph uh, I have a photograph of a multitude of sh types of shoes. In some way that uh, symbolises for me all ways forward are good. So that as I process her death and uh, I go forward into the rest of my life that uh, all paths are good. Uh, so that's what my last photograph of transitions uh, symbolises. I've been around on the gay scene since I was in my early 20s and once I got past 30 it became very obvious that when you are an older gay person the scene really doesn't have a lot for you and I think a lot of older LGBT get very isolated, they don't feel there's anything for them in the gay community, they feel that nobody's interested in them and yet we all still have our our needs, our loves, our, our desires, our fears, our hopes. And I think this has been an excellent project to bring that out and bring that to the fore so that the world knows that there are older LGBT out there 
and uh, you know that they are wanted and needed in our community. Thank you.